Hello, I'm John Hain with the Office of Student Financial Assistance at the Maryland Higher Education Commission. I'm here today to discuss Maryland's new 2 plus 2 transfer scholarship program, which is designed to encourage Maryland community college students to transfer to a four-year institution within Maryland. To qualify for this award, you must at least be a Maryland resident and have filed your FAFSA by March 1st, have earned an associate's degree from a community college within Maryland with a minimum cumulative GPA of 2.5, and to be enrolled or intending to enroll in a degree program at a public or private four-year institution within Maryland. Also, males need to be registered with the Selective Service. And finally, you'll need to demonstrate need with an expected family contribution, known as EFC, of less than $10,000. To be considered for this award, you'll need to apply online through your MDCAPS account between January 1st and March 1st. This is also when you should be filing for your FAFSA, so you'll probably want to do these at the same time. So now that you've applied, how much can you expect to receive? That depends on your major. Science, teaching, engineering, computer science, mathematics, or nursing programs qualify for a $2,000 award. All other majors are eligible for a $1,000 award. These awards may be renewed for a total of three years of study or six semesters of study, whichever is longer. But to be eligible for renewal, the student must remain a resident of Maryland, remain enrolled as a full-time student, 12 or more credits, in a Maryland four-year institution of higher learning, maintain a cumulative GPA of at least 2.5, and continue to meet the academic standards of their institution. Who will be awarded? While need is a prerequisite, this is really a merit-based scholarship. Students who demonstrate superior academic ability as demonstrated by their cumulative GPA while in community college will receive priority consideration. Successful applicants will be notified by email and must then accept their award through their MDCAPS account. Further information on this process may be found on our website. That's all there is to it. So good luck and remember to file your FAFSA by March 1st. And if the 2 plus 2 scholarship looks interesting, be sure to apply for it at the same time.